Have you ever wondered what life would be like if Earth was a moon of Jupiter? Imagine our world, not as the third rock from the Sun, but rather as a celestial body caught in the massive gravitational pull of the largest planet in our solar system. As we know, Jupiter, with its diverse collection of over 60 moons, is a fascinating celestial giant. Its magnetic field and intense radiation belts creating a dramatically different environment from what we know on Earth. So, what would it mean for our planet to be in such a position? How would our blue sphere change under the influence of the gas giant? These are the questions that draw us into a realm of astronomical wonder and speculation. And as we explore this concept, we will delve into the profound implications it could have on our planet, from its geology, to its climate, and even life as we know it. Join us as we delve into this fascinating topic. To understand this scenario, we first need to understand Jupiter. Now, Jupiter is not just another planet in our solar system, it's a behemoth. It's the largest planet, in fact over 1,000 times the volume of Earth. That's right, you could fit more than a thousand Earths inside Jupiter and still have room to spare. But size isn't everything. Jupiter is primarily composed of hydrogen and helium, much like our Sun. There's no solid ground to stand on, just a gradual transition from the outer atmosphere to a dense core of metallic hydrogen, under immense pressure due to Jupiter's massive gravitational pull. Speaking of gravity, if you were to stand on Jupiter, hypothetically of course, you'd weigh more than twice what you do on Earth. That's a diet nobody wants to be on. Now let's talk about Jupiter's moons. Jupiter is like a miniature solar system, with a staggering 67 known moons orbiting it. The four largest, known as the Galilean moons, are some of the most fascinating bodies in our solar system, each with its own unique geology and potential for life. Jupiter isn't just a gentle giant, though. It has a magnetic field 20,000 times stronger than Earth's, creating intense radiation belts that could fry any unprotected spacecraft. It also boasts the most extreme weather in the solar system, with storms larger than our entire planet and winds whipping around at hundreds of kilometers per hour. And let's not forget the Great Red Spot, a storm that's been raging for at least 300 years. That's longer than any storm on Earth. It's so large that three Earths could fit inside it. There's a lot more to Jupiter than meets the eye. It's a world of extremes, from its size and composition to its magnetic field and weather. Now that we have a better understanding of Jupiter, let's explore what would happen to Earth. Imagine Earth, our home, orbiting Jupiter instead of the Sun. This concept might seem like something straight out of a sci-fi movie, but let's dive into the potential implications. Firstly, let's address the elephant in the room, our climate. Our current distance from the Sun allows us to enjoy a relatively mild climate, making Earth a suitable place for life as we know it. However, if Earth were to orbit Jupiter, we would be significantly farther from the Sun. This shift could plunge Earth into a perpetual winter with temperatures dropping drastically. The polar ice caps could extend to cover most of the planet, turning Earth into a frigid icy sphere. Now let's talk gravity. Jupiter, being the colossal planet that it is, has a gravitational pull more than two and a half times stronger than Earth's. This means that if Earth were to orbit Jupiter, we could experience a noticeable increase in our planet's gravity. It's like the sensation of carrying an extra backpack all the time. Lastly, let's consider our day-night cycle. Right now, Earth takes 24 hours to complete one rotation, giving us our familiar pattern of day and night. But Jupiter rotates much faster, completing one spin in just under 10 hours. If Earth were to match this, our days and nights could be less than half as long as they are now. Imagine having to squeeze everything you do in a day into less than 10 hours. So, if Earth were to orbit Jupiter, we might find ourselves in a perpetually cold world, weighed down by stronger gravity and rushing through shortened days. It's a world that seems alien and unforgiving, a stark contrast to the home we know and love. But what about life on Earth? Would it be able to withstand such drastic changes? Life as we know it could be drastically different if Earth was a moon of Jupiter. Picture this. A world where the chill in the air is not just a winner's quirk, but a constant companion. A world where every step you take feels heavier and harder. This could be our reality if Earth was orbiting Jupiter instead of the Sun. In this alternate reality, the first thing to consider is the temperature. Jupiter, being much further from the Sun than Earth, receives only about 1 25th of the sunlight we're accustomed to. This would plunge our world into a perpetual winter, far colder than anything we've ever experienced. In such extreme cold, many of the life forms we know today might struggle to survive. From the tiniest microorganisms to the largest mammals, life on Earth would need to adapt to these frigid conditions or perish. 
But it's not just the cold we'd have to worry about. The gravitational pull of Jupiter is over two and a half times stronger than that of Earth. This increased gravity could have profound effects on all life. Plants might grow shorter and sturdier to withstand the greater force. Animals might evolve into more robust forms with stronger muscles and bones to carry their weight. The biodiversity we enjoy on Earth today could be dramatically different under these conditions. Certain species might thrive in this new world, while others may become extinct. However, it's also possible that the harsh conditions could spur evolution, leading to the emergence of new species uniquely adapted to this colder, heavier world. And what about us? Humans are remarkably adaptable. We've survived ice ages and harsh environments before. But could we adapt to a life where the sky is perpetually dark? The air is always cold and every step is a struggle? It's a question that challenges us to think about our own resilience and adaptability. So, could humans survive in such a scenario? As we delve into this thought-provoking question, we'll explore the fascinating possibilities of human survival and adaptation in the next section. Could humans survive if Earth was a moon of Jupiter? This question plunges us into a realm of imagination, but with a basis in science, hinting at the resilience and adaptability of our species. The challenges we would face, should our blue planet find itself in the orbit of the gas giant, would be significant. Jupiter's intense radiation belts would pose a major threat to life as we know it. This harmful radiation would necessitate the development of advanced shielding technologies not only for our habitats, but also for our bodies. Our biological clocks, attuned to a 24-hour cycle, in order to survive, we would need to develop new technologies to harness energy, perhaps from Jupiter's strong magnetic field or from the intense volcanic activity of its moon, Io. While these conditions seem harsh, they might not be insurmountable. After all, humans have proven time and again our ability to adapt to extreme environments. From the icy tundra of the Arctic to the scorching deserts of Africa, we have found ways to not only survive, but thrive. In this new world, we might evolve to become a spacefaring species, taking advantage of Jupiter's proximity and the presence of its other moons. We could establish colonies, explore new worlds, and perhaps even encounter other forms of life. In the grand scheme of evolution, the transition from Earth to a moon of Jupiter would be a monumental leap. Yet, it's not entirely outside the realm of possibility. We are, after all, a species defined by our ability to adapt, to innovate, and to overcome the challenges that nature throws our way. It's a fascinating concept to ponder, isn't it? Let's summarize what we've learned today. We ventured into the realm of imagination and science, exploring the possibility of Earth as a moon of Jupiter. We learned about the immense size and magnetic field of Jupiter and how its gravitational pull would affect our planet. We discovered the potential changes to Earth's climate, atmosphere, and tides, and how these could drastically alter life as we know it. We pondered the survival and adaptation of life under these new conditions, considering both the challenges and opportunities that would arise. We delved into the fascinating facts and theories about Jupiter and its moons, and how they could provide insights into our own future if Earth were to become one of them. This journey has not only challenged our understanding of the universe, but also sparked our curiosity about the endless possibilities that lie within it. Thank you for joining us on this interplanetary journey. Remember, the universe is full of endless possibilities and wonders waiting to be discovered.